For the past four years, I've been using an incredibly simple six-step marketing funnel to convert new leads into paying customers. This funnel is so simple and effective, and yes, it has made me millions of dollars. And I'm about to share the whole thing with you, so keep watching. Hey Posse, what's up? It's Alex coming at you this week with a video to help you capture and convert more customers in your business. If you're new to the crew, welcome. Make sure to subscribe below and don't forget to hit that bell to be notified when my next tutorial goes live. Now, first things first, let's talk about what a funnel actually is because it is a word you hear a lot in the marketing world. So a funnel is simply referring to the journey a new lead takes as they interact with your brand. As they move from being completely unaware of you and what you offer at the top of the funnel, moving all the way to the bottom of the funnel where they hopefully become paying and repeat customers. And it's the touch points between that make up the structure or framework of your funnel. And it goes without saying that there are a ton of different frameworks you can follow. Funnels can be simple and they can be complex with different upsells and downsell pathways and fancy segmentation and retargeting campaigns and all of that jazz. But that is not the type of funnel that we're going to talk about today. For the first four years of my business, I used a very, very simple sales funnel. Like, I mean, dead simple. And I was able to generate over a million dollars in my first year from it. And I'm literally just now starting to build up my funnels into more complex structures. And this leads me to the biggest misconception in marketing today, that if you want to grow, you need a fancy funnel. The number of times I've heard people say, I need to fix my funnel or my funnel isn't working, or I need a new funnel, 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 funnel. And yes, at the end of the day, while your marketing funnel is important, it's the messaging behind the marketing that makes the biggest impact. So if your funnel isn't working, it's because your messaging is falling flat. So fix that and you can have one very simple funnel that your entire business is based on because that is exactly what I did. So with that, let me show you this super simple six step funnel that has made me millions of dollars. So step one, traffic. The number one goal at the very top of your marketing funnel is to get attention, AKA more eyeballs on your stuff. We call this impressions or views in the marketing world and then converting those views into clicks which is what we call traffic. There are many different ways that you can go about getting traffic to your content or to your website. Organic traffic via SEO, content marketing, social media, affiliate marketing, sponsored traffic, or paid ads. Now, if you're thinking, oh great, I already can't do this because I cannot afford to run ads, let me stop you right there because you do not have to run paid ads in order to use this funnel. The reality is it's not realistic for many brands and businesses out there to run ads when they're just starting out because many don't have the budget to actually pay for that media right away. So if that's you, don't stress, don't worry, this funnel can still work extremely well for you. And in the first year of my business, I actually didn't spend a single cent on paid ads. I built my business 100% organically via my social channels and YouTube videos like this one. And anytime and every time it made sense, I would promote a lead magnet and drive people to my site to sign up for my email list. Which leads me to step number two, landing page. So once you've got some eyeballs on your stuff, it's time to turn those lurkers into leads. Your goal is to get them to go one step further with you so you can continue to build that relationship with them and move them through your funnel. Now, it's gonna be really rare for someone to buy from you if they literally just discovered who you are. So instead of asking them to buy right away, you wanna get them to make what's called a micro commitment. And the best way to do this is to invite them to join your email list. But hey, we all know that join my email list isn't the most compelling call to action. You gotta offer them something valuable in exchange for their email address, which leads me to the next component you need in your funnel. Number three, a high value lead magnet. So your goal with the lead magnet is to give away something highly valuable for free. That's why I'm drawing this as a pot of gold right here because it has got to be good. You really wanna make sure this is something that will move them closer to their desired goal. It needs to solve a problem and offer next steps that invites them, yes, to go deeper into the funnel and deeper with your brand. Now, I have an entire tutorial breaking down my lead magnet formula, and I will link to that in the description box below. But just to give you a quick idea, your lead magnet could be anything from a checklist, a cheat sheet, a guide, a webinar, a workshop, a masterclass, you name it. And of course, in order to access the lead magnet, they need to input their email address, which will then deliver the lead magnet to their inbox and voila, you have a new lead on your email list. Now it's time for them to drop into the next component of your funnel, which is step four, indoctrination emails. So once you've got that fresh lead on your email list, you can begin the process of nurturing them through a series of emails often referred to as indoctrination emails or welcome emails. Now, the purpose of these emails are to build up more desire and awareness and trust by providing valuable and relevant content. Yes, 
more value people, we need to give the people value. So instead of hard selling, your primary goal with these emails is to educate your prospects on who you are and why you're uniquely qualified to help them. This is a great time to share who you are, what you stand for, and most importantly, that you understand them and their unique challenges and obstacles. And again, just like the lead magnet, I have a full tutorial dedicated to breaking down my three-step indoctrination formula. So if you wanna get more help on that step, you can find a link to that in the description box below. All right, now, after you've indoctrinated your leads with some amazing, amazing welcome emails, you can move them into the next step of your funnel, which is step number five, sales emails. Okay, so up until now, you haven't really directly made an offer, right? But you've been seeding the sale in your welcome emails and offering them a ton of free value, education, and tips to help them solve their biggest pain point. Now it's time to let them know that you have something to offer them that will make solving their pain point easier, faster, or better than if they were to do it all alone. And this is where sales emails come in. So I recommend sending a minimum of six sales emails including one to introduce your product and offer, one to educate on the benefits of how it can help your audience, one to showcase social proof and build authority, one to stack the value, one to overcome objections, and finally one to convey incentive and scarcity. Now, all of these emails will have a call to action or button that will link directly back to the final part of your sales funnel where they will hopefully convert and buy from you. And that is step number six, a sales page. So this is where you present them with your amazing offer and turn their interest into desire and then of course action. Now, yes, this is the big one that most brands and businesses are focused on getting right, simply because this is the page that actually sells the product or service, AKA where you finally make some money. And listen, there are tons and tons of sales page formulas that you can find online, but over my decade of experience in the marketing world, I have found this 10 step formula to be the winner time and time again. Now, this quick checklist includes 10 conversion triggers that I always look for when reviewing copy to build trust, boost authority and ignite sales. And you can grab Grab your free copy of this checklist in just a second. All right, and there you have it, a simple funnel that has made me millions of dollars, traffic, landing page, high value lead magnet, indoctrination emails, sales emails, and of course your sales page. So if you are ready to take all of this knowledge from tactical to practical, then make sure to check out my eight week copywriting coaching program, The Copy Posse Launch Files. Inside this program, I teach you exactly how to write each and every asset that I talked about today, including the formulas, the guides, and the step-by-step -step training to help you write a million dollar funnel. So you'll find the link to get started right away in the description box below, and you'll find the link to my hot offer checklist in just a second at the end of this video. I hope you enjoyed this. Give me a thumbs up if you want to see more marketing videos like this, and I will see you next time. Until then, I'm Alex. Ciao for now. All right, guys, if you enjoyed that video, make sure to check out the next one from me right here, and you can click right here to get a free gift. Your email list is one of the most valuable assets you can have in your business. And in order to grow your email list, you need to learn how to create a killer lead magnet. So in this video, I'm gonna break down the exact three-step lead magnet formula that I follow to attract highly qualified leads and then turn those leads into sales. Keep watching.